Agent Vodello? I have been ordered to report here for levitation training. I've already done the coach's obstacle course, and Sasha showed me how to shoot. You know, I'd expect that sort of recklessness from Orso, but Sasha? Agent Nine said you were the most powerful levitator the Psychonauts had. Sasha said that? Really? I didn't know you noticed. Well, you know, I only work with the best teachers. Flirt? Okay, let's party. Look who made the scene. Agent Vodello? Where are you? On TV, of course. Where I was always meant to be. I mean, look at my hair, darling. How can hair this fabulous not be on TV? Now, darling, the best way to learn levitation is to just try it. I'm going to give you a levitation learner's permit. It will only work while you're in my mind. After you finish my course, I'll give you the real thing, baby. First, you gotta show me you know how to use it. Now bounce on up here and follow me, darling. There you go. Now for this last one, you're really going to have to fly. Once you get up in the air, try using your thoughts as a balloon to float. Just jump for those rings as high as you can and then do your side float. Don't be afraid, darling. Okay, now, just between you and me, this end of the party is dead. Come find me on the other side of the party, and I'll give you that merit badge for real. Never keep a girl waiting long, young man. Stay on the ball in here, Rasputin, if you want to get higher. And see if you can get all those rings spinning, Mr. DJ. the sugar in my bowl, darling. Now just follow the flowers, won't you? And try to stay rolling at all times. That is the theme of this party. Fantastic! What style you have, young man! Now, I'm not saying that you will fall, but if you ever did, I'll put a ball return down here for you. Just jump in there if you need to come back up here in a hurry. 
darling, float over here, will you? These rings aren't spinning and they are ruining my party. Remember to use your psi float. I'm not saying it won't ever let you down, but it will let you down nice and slow. Thank you, sweetie. I feel so much better now. Come on, let's take it a little higher now. Ooh, look at the crowd. Things are starting to pick up. See that draft up above, darling? Jump into it and float and see where it takes you. If you're not on the ball when you enter that circle, you might be seeing stars instead of being one.
when you are levitating, hmm, that shouldn't be happening. Darling, do you have some problems with water? Do you want to talk about it? Uh, it's a long story. Maybe later. Okay, I'm always here for you, darling. Let me just say that it's very normal for boys your age. my party in no time, eh? Okay, if you want to get up to where the action is, you're going to have to do a lot of floating in this room, baby. Good thing you're so light on your feet.
float in some areas, you might get a little more oomph than usual. your side float again to get those rings spinning. It's Rasputin, the rolling rock star, in the flesh! And just in time, the party was dying without you, darling. Here, I have a little party favor for you. Cute. Don't be a stranger, darling. Thank you, Agent Vodello. Now it's back to the lab to save Dogen. Dogen's not in the lab, sweetie. He's watching TV in the lodge with the other children. I meant the dream Dogen from my brain tumbler vision. If I can find out what's happening to him, maybe that would give me a clue about who stole real Dogen's brain. Oh, I'm afraid he's just like that.
that great when I beat you in that levitation race? smell like garbage. Mental cobwebs getting you down. I've got just the device up here in the main large store. Why don't you come on up and score yourself a cobweb duster before they're all sold out? That's my last cobweb duster. Take that into someone's mind. That's it for you. now. You hey, anything? Take a. Oh, that's my last cobweb duster. Mmm, dreep. Now, you take that psi cord. Now, with that, you. Ah, now, here's something every young psi cadet needs. Now, that's you take it for that psi cord. All right, go get more air. Kitty. Come on back. Hey, you guys are good. Thanks, man. Hey, do you. And come. Oh, right. <laughs> Would you like me to take you, Agent? Bring me near the rod. To do with small bully assistant? Geez, I don't know. Could you put him in that deadly Nelson you were talking about? Ah! Shut up, Benny! On the other hand, blood and tongue swells, pops, and less mess that way. Mouth stuffed with just. Ah! Shut up, Benny! You have something less drastic? Uh, could you? What's that? Like deadly Nelson, but less dying. How much less? Easy. What happens the other half of the time? Opponent leaves. Spends the rest of short life praying for death. Hey! Can you hear me down there? Maloof? Shut up, Benny! Seriously, Maloof. I apologize. 
a call off your goon, and I'll never bother you again. Ever. The thing is, Benny, you're never going to bother me again either way. So you're going to have to offer something a lot better than that. Like what? Any ideas, Mikhail? No one you think about giant, hairless bear? No. Out of ideas. Preparing Nelson. Well, wait, wait. Maybe, uh, yeah, maybe I did see something like that. Uh, give me a minute to think. You ready to talk, Benny? Hold on, it'll come to me. Can't get a good grip. Hey, I could. Well, that's great. You can just float up on out of this forest there. Because the forest, it's off limits. Now get! You know, Chloe, for a chick whose face I can't see because she's always wearing a helmet, I'm not human, Earth Primate. But you are the girl mo- Affirmative. At this point- Man, what smells like butt? But- It'd be a real shame. Hi- Bobby, we need to work on you a little. aren't going around taking people's brains out, are you? Not, You're not yet, going to, but, uh, uh, maybe we should kill do some Benny, market research on that and, and see if there's a demand for that service. Hey! You're lucky the boss is generous today. Oh. You're lucky the boss is generous today. On sale now in the main store, we have a special on Dream Fluffs. You hear me? Dream Fluffs! They're good for you. Keep a pocket full of these for a quick boost of mental health. Okay. I'm a certified limitator now. Ready to roll. Hmm. I've been running some tests. It seems that the sensitive circuitry of the brain tumbler is picking up too much psychic interference to be safe. The thoughts of some other entity are interlacing with yours at a dangerous level, which explains many of the strange things you've seen. I must call off the experiments until we know more. Sasha, there's no time. I think my vision about Dogen came true. I'm worried it's gonna happen to the others if we don't get to the bottom of this quick. But we don't know where the foreign projections are coming from yet. Is there a faster way to find out than sending me in there to investigate? Man, these things smell terrible. Yes.